Yeah. So, um, <laughs> what happened? That I don't know because we are getting on fine and that and things were going good and the plan was that when I was in Italy, I was going to meet up with him for two weeks because what's today's date? Mm. I wasn't going to. I wasn't going to get home. Yeah, I wasn't going to get home to like the twentieth or so. Yep. So we're going to spend time, you know, doing the road trips, yep. going to gyms, just filming content. Never got back to me. Never got back to me. Never got back to me. And I'm like, and then now, September was the last time he paid me. So September, October, November, December haven't been paid. And he first said it was due to he changed banks or something. And then there's something. Well, even if he changed banks and shit, it doesn't. They don't yep. hold your money for fucking months. So he wasn't replying. They said, "Well, the promoters right. I got my ticket because he paid paid for me to go over there. So I told the guy who flew me over, send me back on the like twentieth. So the, Aaron, you would have to pay for the airfare or anything. Yeah, I was just trying to get Aaron. Do you want to meet me in Italy? Then we road trip from there. Or do you want me to come from Italy to UK and then we come back? Never heard. Never heard until I put up a story and somebody asked me about. It. I said, oh, I don't know. Aaron hasn't paid me." Boom, message, take that down. It's making me look bad and blah, blah. I'm thinking, well, that's being truthful. You've made your life out of being truthful. Well, you said you copied me, but he's always gone off about the same shit online. So, but now I've just said that. And then I put that video up on Instagram the other day just saying I haven't been paid. I was respectful saying he was a good friend and that. And but he's, and he said, I will pay you. I'll pay you at least the last two, which I haven't got, which would be good if he did right now because I think it's like... 51 cents the yep. pound so it'd be almost double but haven't heard and I, I know his sister was going through chemo and that and I think she's come out okay and I just said well look I got shit going with Ray you know because Ray's got his liver lung and spinal cancer going on still yep. so never heard back and then I sent him a nice message again just explaining everything and showed Rachel that's a very nice message he read it never replied so that's all he can do, I guess, isn't it? But then I heard other people said he had problems. The guy who does his tyres, Ish, or well, Ish does the body kits on his cars, yep. and then six one or whatever. I think they do the tyres. And he sent me a thing. Um, where was it? Oh, uh, here, because he was asking. I had actually a few people asked me what's going on with Aaron because they've been friends forever. He was saying, look, we looked after Aaron from day one. He knocked the kid that wraps the trucks 1,200 pounds and threatened his mum. He knocked the part supplier from 612, that's the wheel place, I think, eight grand and sent his sister, who has cancer, to my shop collect, collecting the last mental truck and never honoured the invoice for 7K. Didn't even have the balls to call me face-to-face, -face, saying saying I'm not paying you just disappointed I said yeah I don't know what's happening with him he goes this would just use him Lee because I said you know maybe because he's in with the you know the club he's getting into the Hells Angels and that and maybe on severely he owes HMRC over 250k I don't know who, who they are they are closing his companies one by one he's on borrowed time mate I took his company to court he didn't even fight it. The court awarded me the claim. Soon as the money's in my account, it'll make it. I'll make it public and let everyone know about it. I, I just said, "Well, that's crazy." I said, "He said that's actually a joke, considering because I just said what he owed me, considering your name in the game." But more to the point, where is his honour? His word, my word is my bond, always delivered. Blah blah blah. He can't pay you as he has no money made his accounts prove that he doesn't I said yeah I considered him I just wrote back so I considered him family from the beginning you know when I used to help him in the beginning labelling yep. the bottles and taking them down to the thing and then even when COVID come along I said to him look let's just stop the contract because you're a friend I felt guilty taking your money that's when I went to Dave yep because I couldn't do anything so I said you know you're a friend I don't want to just you give me money for nothing then I just said about he's being the club 100% the club are going to shaft him which they might for him and then he just said yeah really sorry you never got paid mate and then he's like 
he don't want people then he said exactly I just said yeah I have no idea why he's acting this way when people have done nothing but help him then this guy Ish wrote back exactly I actually did thousands for him for free and labour and that it's nuts so there's been a few people say that he's sort of changed and gone a bit off the thing which is sad but I don't know what he's going through or you know well, I actually um, sent him a message on um, Messenger just to say um, that uh, is there anything I can do to bring you two back together because, you know, I know from my time with you that you're mates with him and you had great times and, you know, I don't know Aaron personally, mm-hmm. but, you know, from his oh, content shit, we've been together or what friend since from back what would have just been almost just after the universe 2013 yeah. or 15 i did a tour with him or 14 and yeah so i sort of just said oh look is there anything i can do to help mm. you know i know um look i whatever is with his business that's just speculation mm-hmm uh, he 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 might be perfectly fine and yeah. and um. Well, like I said, he it, seems to be because when I look at his videos, he's still doing those good car giveaways. He's giving yeah, away yeah. cash and stuff like that, so it seems to be going fine. But even like I said, the messages I sent him, like I said, because I'm already over there, so he wasn't replying because I'm trying to organise when to hook up with him to do all this stuff. And then even the money thing, like even if he had just said, look, Lee, I am going through money problems right now, blah, 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 can I just send you this or something? But he didn't reply at all. Like I said, he only replied when I, and all I said was in one story, oh, Aaron hasn't paid me. That's when he went off. I'm like, I didn't say nothing bad. I just said, I was only saying you haven't paid me. And come on, Aaron, it's like, you do videos calling everybody out. I'm sure if someone didn't pay Aaron for three months, there'd be videos all over the internet about it. So, oh. Well- I guess what the point of my message was, you know, I, I, you don't want to see two mates fall out, and basically it could be just a communication thing. You don't mm-hmm. know he might be, he he might be stressed out, and he might, um, you know, so someone might have left his business that pays the bills, or they've made a mess of it, and mm-hmm. and you know he might have all the. But money I did that for a while there, like his sister when she was going through cancer, she was the one in charge of all that, and Eddie. Eddie took over so for a little while there like he even said that you know Eddie's just yeah. taken over this was one of the payments was late I said that's fine because Eddie was just getting used to yeah, doing yeah. all the bank transfers and that so that was fine so yeah so there was that for a while there while Natalie was sick and that so yeah but I'm just like mm. yeah no look at you know if, if, did he reply or did you get blocked no no I, 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 I mean he <laughs> hasn't hasn't got back to me and and um <laughs> You know, I could imagine he gets a lot of messages every day. Well, I think someone said a lot of his stuff now and his thing he's turned all the comments off on his Instagram, so... But, um, yeah, so, look, you don't know. He he might be waiting on a shitload of money from someone else and that mm-hmm. that, that disrupts the mm-hmm. chain and... Yeah, well, that's what so I even said to him. I said, look, you know, but even the, one of the messages is like, you know, just a simple, like, mm-hmm. you know, explain something, don't just ignore me. You know, just say, well, these people haven't paid me, they haven't paid me, or or, or even if it was like, okay, Lee, well, what do you need just mm-hmm. for, if I can't give you the full amount, let me just send you this to get you, you know, because yeah. like I said, I said, you know, I have other little contracts, but those other little contracts that come from S-Force or whatever, I put that into savings accounts, you know, it's like those silly savings accounts you put in, but then if you go and take money out, you lose all your interest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Aaron's, when he's came in, that was the main one I was just using yeah. for live off and bills and stuff so I was like I don't want to have to dip into that one because then the bank goes oh goodbye interest we yeah, take that yeah. back so <laughs> yeah so um, well, let's go back to the OnlyFans I'm starting up now yeah <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Um, do we get any hits on that at all um, man we're ready to rock and roll um, unreal you can um, be mentored by um, Matt he, he'll uh, he'll steer you through I'm the d- I don't even need mentoring I'm just going to wing it what the hell's on if these? we could um, 